What's good, YouTube? And welcome back to a brand new video. Look, man, if y'all new into the channel, I need y'all to do me a few favors. Number one, like this video. I'll appreciate it. Number two, subscribe to the channel. I'll appreciate it. Number three, make sure y'all turn on that bell, man. So whenever I drop a new video, you will be notified. Once again, I'll appreciate it. Today's shout out goes to Jazz93. Once again, shout out to Jazz93. Also, if y'all not following me on Instagram, make sure y'all go over there and follow me at keep working underscore zero zero. Once again, that's keep working underscore zero zero. Especially if y'all want to say a different side of me from here on YouTube. Look, man, I need y'all to do me a favor and watch this entire video, bro, because it's helped me out on YouTube a lot. But here in today's video, we're going to be talking about the video that Cryer just dropped or whatever. He titled it like, you know, I got exposed, but I'm ready to celebrate by going shopping. Something like that, man, a video that Mr. Cryer just dropped not too long ago. We already talked about it. I apologize if y'all hear noise in the background. The air is on, but if it's too, like, if it's too noisy, just let me know down in the comment section below. And next time I'll make sure that the air is off. But with all of that out the way, let's get into the video. All right, bro, for the people that don't know, I was live probably like one o'clock in the morning, bro. And I was talking about Love by Erica Live or whatever that she did about her and Mr. Cryer and Mr. Cryer trying to send her to jail for six months. And I'm gonna say it again right now, bro, this is a shocker to me. Now the situation is not a shocker, you know, as far as them going to court and stuff, because I do remember Cryer you know, Ben saying that he was going to take Erica to court, you know, back in April, like he said in this video or whatever, back, I think he said April 19th or whatever this year, but he took the video down where he private it. But yeah, I do remember, you know, him talking about that in that video, but I thought that they been handled it a while ago for real. So it was kind of a shocker from, you know, Erica going in at Mr. Mucker so much, you know, you know, to her going on going on to Mr. Cryer talking about how Mr. Cryer was trying to get her locked up for six months, which is crazy, by the way, bro. So it was just kind of a shocker that she went from Mucker to Cryer like that. But who knows, bro? She probably not done with Mucker yet either. Now, in that video, Mr. Cryer, he said that he moved forward and he did everything that he said he was going to do. Now, from Cryer's perspective, that's good that he did that. Because if you wouldn't have did that, you would have been looking crazy to other people probably like, you know, what happened, what happened? And y'all know that a lot of people, bro, they don't like Erica for real. And a lot of people don't like Cryer for real. So you knew the people that don't like Erica, they probably would have been like, oh, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on with the court stuff? Blase, blase, blase. I know that it would have been somebody that would have brought that up, bro. So, you know, Cryer said he moved forward with everything, bro. And he's not going to do that much talking. He was saying like, you know, these days, here in 2024, he a man of little words for real. He just let his actions speak for him and he just do less talking. Also, Mr. Cryer was saying, you know, the last thing that he want to do is get on here and do silly stuff. You know, happy, he in a relationship. Now, I could be wrong, but when he say like, you know, silly stuff, I think that he's talking about, you know, like far as going back and forth, making multiple videos, basically doing a service. And Cryer eyes, he probably, you know, calling it silly. Cause he's like, look, we did this before. We've been here. We've done that. I'm not doing it. You know, I'm in a relationship now. I'm happy. And he even mentioned how, you know, like it's embarrassing. It embarrasses him, his lady, you know, and his family. And speaking of so-so, bro, cause I said this in my live yesterday. If y'all ain't go watch that live, man, it's like two hours and something. So yeah, man, go tune in. Cause we was lit over there. But speaking of so-so, and I said this in my live as well, bro, the criticism that so-so was getting, I don't believe that it's fair because at the end of the day, I don't think that so-so had anything to do with this. You know, as far as like the whole court stuff that Cry and Erka is going through, I don't think that it's fair for so-so to be getting backlash for it. And, you know, she really don't got nothing to do with this. So, like I said, that's kind of unfair in my opinion that people was doing that and he bringing her into it. But like I said, bro, that's the thing. When it comes to like, you know, Cry and Erka, when they get in new relationships, bro, they probably gonna be brought into the mess by default, bro. Because of their history and you know their history together, whether it was good or bad, people just wanna bring their partner that don't got nothing to do with it. They're gonna just bring them into it anyway. But like I said, I, I feel like that's unfair, bro. And so so, maybe she don't care. Maybe she don't care because Cryer said you know he don't hide nothing from her. So I'm pretty sure Cryer didn't told her all of this stuff about the whole court stuff about how, you know, the stuff that him and Erica went through with their kids and et cetera, et cetera. I'm pretty sure Cryer set up there and told so-so all of that. 
But yeah, like I said, man, Cry, he was saying, you know, to go back and forth with anyone, it's embarrassing. When he say anyone, I know that he's talking about Erica, but he's just not going to mention her name. But I feel like he is talking about Erica when he say he's not going back and forth with anyone. And kudos to Cryer, bro. If Cryer want to move different and stuff, and he was mentioning that, how he's moving different now. If he want to move differently, bro, didn't do that. I'm not even going to sit up here and not Cryer for not, you know, getting on here, addressing stuff that people want him to address. But I will say this, bro, because I got to be real. Far as him trying to get Erica locked up for six months, that is crazy, bro. And I say that because if if Erica get locked up for six months, what happens then? You know, like I'm pretty sure like Cryer and his kids that he got with Erica, he probably will take them in and make sure they good. But you know, you got baby Drake and you got um Cam. Cam dad probably take him, but I feel like baby Drake is the odd one left out because we already know what Mucker don't do for baby Drake. So I feel like Baby Drake would be the main one that would be left out for real. So, like I said, man, I don't agree with that. And I feel like, you know, it could have been something else handled in a different way to the point where it's though it wasn't even talking about Arthur going to jail or Cryer going to jail. Therefore, neither one of them going to jail, bruh. Because I just feel like that's just a little too much. And Erica, she got four children that she looked after, bro. So for her to go to jail for six months, that's a long time. You know, especially being away from your kids and they babies at that. So far as Cryer doing that, I don't agree with it. But I'm pretty sure Cryer have his reasons. I don't know if he's going to say his reasons. But me personally, I don't agree with that. But Cryer did say, you know, the stuff that he can keep off social media, he's going to keep it off social media. For real. Like I said, man, if that's what he want to do, man, that's on Cryer. You know, that's his decision, then, you know, that's just his decision. I'm not going to knock him for it, but he, then he started to say, you know, how he got no regrets of, you know, saying what he said and did what he did. The only thing I can say is this, bro, about that, and I just really mentioned it for real, far as him trying to get Eric locked up. I don't agree with that at all, bro. That's crazy. And I just told y'all why it's crazy. All right, and basically, Mr. Cry, he ended that part of the video or whatever. You know, as far as him talking about the situation, the next part, you know, he started going furniture shopping. But as far as that part, you know, he was saying that he didn't want the two situations, you know, intertwined with each other. I guess he was saying, like, you know, he didn't want the whole court stuff to intertwine with him and so-so relationship. That's what I assume that he was talking about. I could be wrong, y'all. What do y'all think he was talking about? But I think that's what Cry was talking about for real, you know, because he didn't really want to drag so-so through this for real. And that's another reason why I feel like he's not going to, you know, go too deep into it. But who knows, bro? Because I ain't going to lie. Cryer, he do do this sometimes, bro. He'd be like, you know, I'm not going to address it. I'm not worried about it. But then he'd drop a video talking about it. So I'm surprised that Cryer even said anything about it at all, bro. I am, but I'm not. Because I, like I said, I know how Cryer can be. He said he's not going to talk about it. And then he talk about it. So... I don't know, bro. He did say that, you know, it's certain stuff that he can't say. It's not that he don't want to say it. He just can't say it right now. Will he say it further on down the line in the, um, in the video on YouTube? We just going to have to wait and see, bro. But I just hope that Eric and Cryer can figure something out eventually, you know, like I said, without anyone being arrested. For real, bro. Anyway, man, let me know what y'all think about this video and the situation down in the comment sessions below. Like subscribe comment do all that good stuff and somebody told me that erica is dropping a video tonight you know i'm gonna try to stay up and watch it bro and y'all know me i'm gonna do a video to that but i'm out peace y'all have a blessed night